Welcome back friends to another technical video on your Tech Handy channel. Please do like, subscribe and hit bell icon to support our efforts. In this video I will demonstrate how we can install and create Synology NAS storage machine on VMware Workstation Pro. First we need to download the Red Pill loader from the GitHub, I shared the link in this video description. Make sure to download VMDK extension file. First we need to unzip the downloaded VMDK disk file to make it accessible. Now open your VMware workstation and select a create new virtual machine option. Follow the screen instructions to create dummy machine. We will attach the downloaded disk file later. Now we need to delete the machine current disk and perform some additional configurations. You must follow same steps in order to successfully create the Synology NAS. Delete the disk from configuration as well as from machine physical path location. You can also remove CD, DVD option. Then configure network configurations as per your requirements. Also, assign resources as per your lab needs. Most importantly, Change the firmware option to BIOS, or else your machine will not boot properly. Now we are ready to import our downloaded Redpill bootloader disk and create few additional storage disk that can later be used as volumes for our Synology NAS. Make sure to create all disks as SATA disks. For safe side, we can expand existing disk capacity from 1 GB to 10 GB. Now, let's create three additional disks 100 GB each.
we are now ready to power on the machine. After booting the loader, the following screen should appear. Copy the machine assigned IP along with port. Open new browser tab and paste same IP and port number. Now follow the steps as showing at screen. Click OK again on boot the loader option. This time you will find different screen with the same IP. Open another browser tab and type in the same IP without port, it will detect 5000 port automatically this time and you will ends up with fresh Synology installation screen. You need to have internet connection enable in order to download and install Synology NAS. Once installation complete, you are ready to create account and start using your Synology NAS. Create storage pool and volume along with appropriate RAID which suit best to your lab environment. If you are new to Synology NAS, Give yourself time to explore more options and make this more beneficial in real-life storage use cases. Thanks for your time and for watching this video, please make sure to like and subscribe.